Yo, what's going on everybody? This is Miss Gold today. I'm bringing you a video going over the 9.2 nerfs that were announced for Miss Weaver this past Tuesday. I'll also put a link to it in the description and I'm just going to talk about what this means for PvP and PvE and what you covenants you should probably be leveling. The TLDR of the nerfs is bonus brew's effectiveness was increased by 5%, but it can no longer critically strike. So if you PvP, it doesn't really affect you that much because this is from a 2900 3k MMR game. The healing from Gustamus and bonus brew doesn't actually crit ever really for us. So it, in PvP, it's not going to affect us that much. In PvE, because you're using bonus brew also for damage and healing, I think it's it's going to have a pretty significant impact for Mythic Plus. Maybe not so much for raiding because you don't really you never went Necrolord for raiding. You primarily went Venthyr. So I think for raiding, you're probably you. I think you want to be Kieran for raids because of the Bone Disprew and the Sinister Teachings nerf. And then for others, Necrolord should be fine. And then the Sinister Teachings reduce the effectiveness of Sinister Teachings by 50%, which is absolutely insane to me. Um, you will no longer be using this for PvP. I used it for RBGs. I will never be using it for RBGs. Mythic Plus, I doubt you'll be using it for Mythic Plus because you can get it down to, what, a 45 second cooldown, which means that it would probably be about a minute and a half cooldown. And then for raids, I don't think you'll be using Sinister Teachings either. So I think Vent Theory is just kind of feels kind of gutted right now but we'll talk about the nerfs and my thoughts uh in the rest of the video the first nerf that i, I a lot of people have heard about but they haven't heard about the second one is bonus bruise effectiveness was increased by five percent and the ability can no longer crit so in the beginning of the video i talked about it but in pvp this doesn't really affect you that much because the, again the ability doesn't really crit you don't even use it off cooldown too much unless you see incoming damage or lining up with the cooldown in pve I think this does have a pretty significant impact because again, you're using Bone Dust Brew for damage as well. And if you can't critically strike, it just, Miss Weavers already have negative damage. Like we have no damage already. And now they're just nerfing it even more. I, I Maybe it evens out, but I really don't think it is. I saw some people talk about it. I don't think it's going to even out. So it's just a nerf to, to Miss Weaver damage in PVE. And it doesn't really have, it's actually kind of a buff for PVP. I'm not gonna lie. It's kind of a buff, it's kind of weird. The second nerf is to Sinister Teachings and it now reduces the cooldown of Fallen Order by two and a half seconds when you critically strike when it was five seconds. So for those you who don't know, Sinister Teachings right now, as it says in there, is every five, every time you crit, when you have Sinister Teachings up with Fallen Order, it reduces the cooldown by five seconds. So if I just use Fallen Order here, and this is my crit set, so I should be able to get quite a few crit. You'll see that my Fallen Order cooldown is just getting reduced. And normally in PvP, yeah, I can get this down to like a minute and a half cooldown. Because in PvP, it's a little bit different. It's not as, you know, I can get kicked and stuff like that. I can get put in CC. In PvE, you could easily get this down to a one minute, 45, one minute or 45 second cooldown. So they gutted it by 50%. And you can see, I mean... Without doing any damage at all, my Sinister Teachings is now a minute 45 cooldown. In PvE, I feel like this is a huge nerf because you're really trying to min-max your globals for your healing output and damage. And it's, I feel like it's just not going to be worth it anymore after these nerfs. Uh, I don't know why they would... I wish there was some reasoning on the patch notes for it, but I guess they just didn't like that our damage came from Sinister Teachings. I, from our little Fallen Order fellas. I don't know. I think it's a weird change, but overall... It, it feels like Vent Deer is not going to be used um, any anymore for Miss Weaver. My thoughts for PVE, I actually feel sorry for all you Miss Weavers at PVE. I really do. I really, I, my heart goes out to you. I know that some Miss Weavers can make it work and it's still tough. So I think the bonus brew is okay, but I, you, it just reduces your damage by a lot. I think you want to probably go Kyrian or Necrolord. I think both are fine. You will never be Night Fae. Kyrian, really good with Weapons of Order and with the two legendaries that you'll be able to use. You're going to have Yulon or Chiji up quite often. So that is pretty good. Kyrian, I feel like might be the go-to for Mythic Plus and raiding. Um, I don't think Venthyr will be used at all for PvE or PvE, PvE or PvP anymore. For PvP, you we already never used Venthyr for anything. I like to play Venthyr because I thought it was fun. I used it for RBGs because it cranks. Like, I'm, Fallen Order is freaking insane. But with the Sinister Teachings cooldown or the Sinister Teachings nerf, I think that it's just not going to be worth it anymore. I think you're better off using Necrolord. You will not be Kyrian or Night Fae. So just stick to Necrolord. We're just going to be Necrolord Gamers the rest of the expansion. I just wish instead of nerfing the best legendaries and the best covenant, they buff the ones that we don't use. Like Night Fae, I would love to be Night Fae. I love the aesthetic of Night Fae. I just wish they would buff it to do something, you know, make the, the failing stomp actually do something instead of having to go into melee range and just, it, I wish they would buff Night Face somehow, buff like the Soul Binds and stuff like that, but 
That's too bad. Also, buff Kyrian because we've never been Kyrian. The only reason we're going Kyrian now is because they're nerfing stuff. I just wish I would buff the covenants that they that we don't use. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Hopefully, this kind of sums up how uh, other misweavers are feeling. If you have any questions or if you have more input, please let me know. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Hope everyone has a fantastic rest of your day. Hopefully, the buff misweaver. And I'll see you later.